Today we're at Bank of America Merrill Lynch and we're doing a codathon for girls between about 5 to about 22. At the heart of this uh, year's coding weekend is the idea of automation to get the children to think about how our future with robots will look like. The girls are building chatbots to a brief of how machines work. My project is called Project Z and it's about how machines and robots work and like there's this robot and he's showing you around and he's like you can go to the future to see different robots doing different things. My group were making a medical advice robot to help you if you're having troubles with finding a diagnosis for an illness. Oh, we're creating a chatbot where we could talk to like a robot online, like Siri. Do I think robots are going to take over the world? Um, I secretly think that might be jellyfish before the robots, uh, but yes, robots probably will take over the world, but we'll still need humans to program them, like the girls have been doing today. I don't think they're going to take over the world because they don't have emotions yet. No, because they're controlled by humans and the humans would have to make them take over the world. Well, I'm in the middle because I do think they're going to take over the world, but I also don't. I feel like robots are going to become more advanced and in that they're going to build emotions, we're going to program that. I don't think robots will take um, over the world because, well, Robots are programmed by humans and if they do take over the world then they're just going to be us. Robots will take over the world and I am waiting in anticipation for the day they do. <laughs> it's just great to see the girls at the end, at the front, um, speaking in their groups, making sure that they've all been a part of the day and just so you can see their pride in their face that they're, they're now a coder. Coding is my form of power. <laughs> It's the way I control a lot of things in my life. I can decide whatever I want to do, whenever, and it's, it's a lot of freedom. I would really, really recommend it because I feel like it will open people's eyes more into how um, girls can code. I think it was really fun because it got girls into coding who maybe wouldn't think of doing it before. The more women you get into the industry, we get more of these unique outlooks on things. Definitely people should come here, have fun, eat food, meet everyone, and just give it a go. Even if they feel like they can't do it, they can. <laughs>